I love sleep because I'm an adult, right? And adults love sleep because being awake is when you have to experience life. That's really what it is. Because sleep's a good testament of like how tough adults' lives are, and it's a great testament of how like amazing children's lives are. Like sl- adults love sleep. Kids' lives are so amazing, they hate going to bed. What? <laughs> Try putting a nine-year-old to bed. They're, you're like, it's time for bed. They're like, no! Please, just 20 more minutes of life. Like, they love it here. <laughs> you can't get them to go to bed, and they wake up early, voluntarily. <laughs> Kids pop up at 7 a.m. on a Saturday. Like, yay, I'm back. All right. <laughs> Free food, no job. I'm going to wake up mom and dad. They're missing out. I mean, this is amazing. Little do the kids know, being awake as an adult, way less fun. It was bedtime for me, I'm like, thank God. I get to temporarily die. <laughs> you know, like, God, I could use a coma. You know, just really shut it down for a while. I was like, so if I ever woke up from a coma, i go back to, I would snooze a coma. I think. <laughs> Even after a year, I'd be like, just five more minutes. I just want to... Not moving is just great. Like, if I ever woke up from a coma, I don't think I would tell anyone I woke up from the coma. I would just pretend I was still in the coma if the doctor came in the room. Just like, oh, shit. <laughs> so now you just lie in bed all day, every day. What a life. Some people idolize Tom Brady. My idol's the grandparents from Willy Wonka. <laughs> what a life they carved out for themselves. Grandpa Joe, what a piece of shit. <laughs> That guy, that guy lies in bed for 20 years. Charlie comes home with a golden ticket. He's like, oh, I can walk. Yeah, you can always walk. This isn't a miracle. You're a scumbag. <laughs> I like to say, sleep's great. Dreams are a bit much. I, life's crazy enough when I'm awake. Then I got to shut my eyes, fall asleep, and my brain's like, Psst, hey, you remember our childhood mailman? <laughs> Well, we're gonna go snorkeling with him. It's gonna be, it's gonna be pretty weird. Then we're gonna judge a spelling bee with last night's Uber driver. Then we're gonna fall off a cliff and wake up sweating. It's gonna be quite a ride. <laughs> we're all such idiots while we're asleep because, like, dreams. The things you dream about are so insane, but we can't tell we're in a dream. Idiots. Dreams are so many red flags where I should be like, you know, something's off. <laughs> I'm just walking around like, checks out, normal day. All right, time to give my friend's aunt a piggyback around my high school science lab. And I never learn my lesson. I wake up every day like, oh, duped again. <laughs> I should have known. I mean, a blowjob cafe? 